friends in this video we are going to discuss uh, the monkey problem of class 7 where the question is uh, there is a water tank and uh, that has steps inside it a monkey is sitting on the topmost step the water level is at the ninth step he jumps three steps down and then jumps back two steps up in how many jumps will he reach the water level means we are asked to find out in how many times the monkey will go downwards and then upwards and then downwards three steps and then uh, backward uh, that is up, upwards two steps like that how many times uh, will the monkey have to jump to reach the water level so let's try to understand uh, this case by the help of a diagram so here we can see uh, there is a monkey over here uh, as per the question the monkey jumps three steps downward that is one two three and then again goes back two steps up that is one two so this downward direction movement and then upward direction movement is to be counted and how many times this downward upward downward upward will keep on going to reach the ninth step by the monkey so let's uh, visualize this even better with the help of the arrows so let's uh, imagine from the first step monkey is jumping downward three steps down that is uh, one two and then three so this is one down downward direction now the monkey will move upward uh, that is uh, one two two steps upward so instead of uh, drawing uh, the uh, jumping path here only I will be representing in uh, this way so that it is a bit clear so let's uh, uh, represent it by dotted line 1 and then 2 upward so at the end what we have to do is we just have to count the arrows that we will be having over here so uh, I repeat again 1 2 3 downward direction then 1 2 upward direction then again from here the monkey will move three steps down that is one two and then three again this arrow is to be counted and again it will go in upward direction two steps so it is one and then two so let's again put it by arrow now again from here three steps downward that is one two three let's put it arrow and again upward two steps uh, one then two then again from here three steps downward one two and then three downward jump and then again the monkey moves upward by two steps one and then two now again from here three steps uh, downward one two and then three and again the monkey moves upward uh, direction by two steps one and then two now from uh, this was the sixth step now from the sixth step again three steps down that is one two and then and then three and this was the target this was the destination of the monkey to reach the water level as we can see water is shown by the dotted lines so here the monkey has reached so what we have to do is we just have to count the arrows that will give us the uh, jumps in downward then upward direction by the monkey so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and eleven so there are total eleven steps taken by the monkey to reach the ninth step where the water level is now in the same fashion we have to solve this uh, second part of the equation which says that after drinking water he wants to go back for this he jumps four steps up and then jumps back two steps down in every move what we have to do is we have to uh, count the uh, jumps of the monkey in how many jumps will he reach back the top step so for solving this again uh, we will be having the diagram so here 
uh, at this time monkey is at ninth step and he has uh, drink uh, he drink the water and now he wants to go back so from ninth step from ninth step he has to go four steps up and then he jumps back two steps down so one two three four so four step but then from here again he goes back because as the person is or the living thing is monkey so uh, their move is like that then again uh, two steps down one and then two now again the monkey travels four steps up one two three and then four and from here again he moves two steps downward that is one and then two and again from here jumps uh, the monkey jumps four steps up that is one two three and four and this is the destination where the monkey actually wants to reach he wanted to reach back the top step and he reached at that place so now let's uh, count the arrows which will give us the number of jumps uh, required by the monkey to start from the water level to reach the topmost step so it is 1 2 3 4 and 5 so total 5 steps 5 jumps we can say total 5 jumps uh, was required uh, or after completing 5 jumps monkey reached the top step now in continuity with the same question the third part says that if the number of steps moved down is represented by negative integers and the number of steps moved up by positive integers represent Uh, the monkeys move in part one and two by completing the following. So, as in part one, we were given that uh, uh, the monkey moves three steps down. So, as it is down, so we are representing it by negative, and then two steps up. So, it is plus two, and there were total eleven jumps uh, that was uh, made by the monkey to reach the water level. So, here only two jumps we have written minus three plus two. Then again. Minus three, then plus two, then again minus three, then plus two, then again minus three and plus two. So again minus three and plus two. So how many uh, we have now? Uh, we have ten. Ten jumps we have uh, written over here. Then again minus three. This is jump one, jump two, jump three. Likewise, jump four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Eleventh jump. So by adding this complete, we are getting minus eight. What does it mean? It means that monkey jumped eight steps downward direction. Eight steps in downward direction. In downward direction, it means that monkey. moved eight steps in downward direction likewise in the second part we were given the monkey uh, jumps four steps down and then two steps up likewise uh, the number of jumps made by the monkey was five so four minus two then again four then again minus two and then again plus four this is jump one this is jump two jump three jump four and this is jump five and adding this adding this we get 8 what does it indicates as it is a positive integer it indicates that the monkey jumped eight steps upward eight steps upward so this is what this minus 8 and plus 8 indicates i request students having difficulty in any other problem or they want me to explain any other topic of any class or any thing related to mathematics can please mention your request in the comment box and i will be keep uploading the uh, videos of uh, mathematics in my coming days thank you